They were supposed to find a safe haven in Henderson. Help me. I don't know. Kessler had better give us the map, or I'll tear his ass a new one. Feel fuck with. Hey, Harlow. Found Kessler's outpost. All right. Find a way in. Better keep my guard up. <clears throat> There's an intercom. Let's see if he answers. Dr. Kessler, open the door. Who is it? What do you want? I really need your help, Kessler. It's extremely important. I am busy doing serious research here. I have no time for visitors. Leave me be. Sir, it's about your research. I uh, read your study on the Kuru disease. It was bloody brilliant. Uh, that's what I wanted to talk to you about.
Something useful? Hmm, this is an article about Marcus's research in biology. Let you in. Now tell me what you want. I need information about the tunnels from the war. Specifically, which one goes to Henderson? There aren't any tunnels. Now get out of here. I am a scientist, not a tour guide. Stop wasting my time. Marcus Villa told me about the tunnels. I know he was your research partner. You saw Marcus? I haven't seen him in ages. He was brilliant, you know, in his own way. But let us just say there are reasons we no longer work together. Very good reasons. Yeah, he wanted to eat me. The guy was certifiable. He wanted to eat you? That doesn't make any sense. Sure, he went to live with the natives, but they've always struck me as peaceful people. Perhaps he was worse off than I even imagined. But that does not explain why he would resort to cannibalism. Yeah, well, he wanted some flesh from someone who's immune to the plague. Had some crazy ideas about using it to make a cure. Wait a moment, are you saying that you are immune to what's happening out there? And then, this certainly changes things, doesn't it? Yes, I'm afraid it does. Yeah, I have a map that you should find helpful. But if you want it, you need to help me with something. I have been researching this disease for many years now. Kuru has been endemic to the indigenous people here for centuries. This outbreak is one of many, and each incident is a little different, as is the trigger that reawakens the plague. It's truly remarkable how this prion disease adapts from changes, how it mutates when exposed to external factors, the speed at which it affects the host organism. Astonishing, really. But science can be unpredictable. Dangerous, even, you understand? Yeah. So is that why there are all those bodies in the greenhouse? A truly unfortunate accident. One that was largely the fault of my assistance. I assure you, I had very little to do with what happened out there. You know, I'm still waiting to hear what you want from me. I am merely trying to make it clear that I am not an evil man. In times such as these, it is easy for men of science to be blamed, persecuted for their actions. Especially by people who possess lesser minds. My four assistants were in possession of some reagents, chemicals, contained within vials. Unfortunately, those vials are out there in the greenhouse. Bring them to me and I will give you the map. Do we have a deal? Sure thing. You will probably need to kill all four of them in order to secure the vials. But there is no saving them now. You will be putting them out of their misery. What's done is done. Just have the map ready to go. I cannot conduct my tests without the reagents. Most of my squad is dead. This task for me and the map is yours. Melby and Howard were lost in Kundera. Johnson was attacked by this... Jesus Christ! ...abomination. Murphy put a bullet in him as his screams were raising the dead. At least they look and smell bloody dead, but... I mean, how can that be? I came from the jungle, from, from everywhere, snarling like hungry animals. And Miller panicked and ran into a whole mob of them. They fell on him like rabid dogs, tore him to pieces. And the rest of us barely made it out alive. I was bitten on the shoulder and the others were sure the infection would take me as well. And soon after we went to sleep, Jenkins tried to murder me. I had no choice but to shoot the bloody maniac. Everyone's scared to death. At this point, our only option is Henderson. At least there's a military base there. Most of our families are there as well. I just hope the city's still safe.
I'll take that reagent. There's one. That's the last one. Time to haul ass. Now I can conduct my tests. I only require a sample of your blood. Oh, you can't be serious. Give me the map before this turns ugly! I am doing a poor job of explaining myself. You are clearly immune, that much is certain. But that does not mean that you are safe. There is a strong possibility that the virus is in your body. And if it is, it could mutate. And depending on how it mutates, you could be in grave danger. All I need is a small blood sample. I'll run a simple test and then we'll know. This is for your own good. Here, do it. Okay, you will feel a little prick. Nothing to worry about. Do this task for me and the map is yours. See, that wasn't so bad, was it? If I had a little sweet, I would give you one. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ on a pony. I was merely trying to lighten the mood. Oh, it will only take a moment to prepare the sample. Please be patient. This is truly astonishing. Got your results. You are completely resistant to the virus. I already knew that, Kessler. No, it is not what you think. Your resistance to the virus has kept it from multiplying, from wreaking havoc on your body. But it has not destroyed the virus. It has merely suppressed it. You need to be very careful. Any contact with certain types of reagents could trigger a mutation. And if the virus mutates, it stands to reason that you could lose your immunity. Or much, much, much worse. Unfortunately, there are so many factors to consider that it is impossible for me to tell you exactly what might happen. But one thing is clear. You should avoid anything that would put you at risk. What are you talking about? Your plan was to use the tunnels to reach Henderson, correct? Yes, the Japanese created them during World War II and later they were used to store chemical weapons. In the 50s, during a monsoon, there was a leak, when some of those chemicals worked their way into the water. The Aussies sent in a battalion of engineers and soldiers to clean them up, but they weren't successful. When they went into the tunnels, one of them must have been infected. The virus mutated and all hell broke loose. The Aussies had to blow the entrances to prevent the infection from spreading. Most of the men were still down in the tunnels. I have long suspected that exposure to those chemicals is what caused the infected soldier to mutate. Anyway, you need to find the old Jesuit mission. A passageway runs from the ruins down into the tunnels. Here is the map, as I promised. I cannot stop you from going down there. That is your decision. But if you do, use an abundance of caution. Try to avoid prolonged exposure to the chemicals. I wish you best of luck. Hapes.
Hello, answer me. Thank God I was starting to worry. Did you get the map from Kessler? Yeah, I got it. Tunnels might be a problem, though. You can fill me in when we meet up. Where are you going now? I'm gonna find the entrance to the tunnels. Will you help me with one important matter? How can I help? We need more data for my research if I'm going to be able to help you. If you're heading to the tunnels, please, be observant. Bring me whatever unusual you find there. Will you? Yep. Excellent. There might be a strange substance or, or a monster that you have not seen before. Maybe some trace from the Australian force.
something useful. and the roads to prevent any movement of the civilian population. And now they're ordering us to kill any villagers who escaped the firebombings. Not just the infected, Got eyes on a door. Everyone. Found some stairs. Men, I think they women, lead down into a crypt. The women are balking at this. Unless you have some diving gear, the answer's We're no. We're to protect these Completely people flooded. who murdered them. I told Colonel Ormsby, my commanding officer, that I would not order my men to murder innocent Roger civilians. Roger that. Colonel Ormsby said refusal to follow orders would be considered gross. Damn it. Jesus, that was close. You good? Okay, Trevor, get us out of here.
vacation is done. Can you bring me a few things? I left some things in her life. So you're going to wander around Since you're a doctor, maybe you can provide tunnels. me with some medical Kid, supplies. You're dead. Been nice knowing you. Not really ready to help just now. I think I'll know how to deal with this water. Ah, uh, we're not going anywhere till that water's dealt with. I need a pump. Before we left, I talked to an old man from Hawaii. He worked in these tunnels when the Aussies were here. And he said there's still equipment in a workroom not far from here. There should be a pump in there. Can you bring it back? Right. Good. Once you bring the pump back, I'll take care of this water. Please, now come what? here. I we just... Like Stay here until they come for us? I need my book. Perhaps I can help. Kite. Wish I could. Catch I me later. I need your help. I hope this Watch pump yourself. idea works. We've wasted too much time already.
Sure thing, mate. I hope it's something good. say this infection is out of control and spreading across the island. I want a family in Henderson, but no one will bloody tell me what's happening there. If they're so worried about containing the bloody infection, why, why would they tell us to evacuate? They said we'd be safer. Did you hear that? There it is. 
support? Are they air dropping supplies for the villagers? I hope so. Those people are starving. It makes sense to drop these supplies as they located the highway in and out. Oh my god, what are they doing? Are they fire bombing the bloody village? Jesus Christ, they're burning them alive! This can't be right! What the hell are they doing? Keep an eye on the place. Hi, come here. Please, come here. I'd like to ask you something. I left some things in her lie. That's it. This better work. Well, if you're ready, all I can say. so am I. I need my book from my clinic. Hi, is this piece of junk here. even gonna work? Yeah, this is an old Rusky machine. Let's hope those commies knew what they were doing. Yeah. Let's see what it can do.
come again. Minds to good use. Behind you! Just don't blow yourself up in the process. Let's lay these mines and protect the perimeter. Extraordinary circumstances require extra. The noise from the pump is going to keep attracting them. And it's going to take a while to drain all that water. There's no way we'll survive with the weapons we have. Hey! I can deploy the mines! They'll help, but they're not going to be enough. Listen, a military chopper went down near the village. None of the poor bastards on board survived the crash, but their weapons might have. Head over there and see what you can salvage. You got it. And get back here as soon as you can. If those things attack while you're gone, we're finished. Holy fuck! Hey, come here. Let's Once we get the water down, the door should Let's be put these mines Hands to good up! use. Just don't blow yourself up in the process. Go look for the chopper. That pump is going to make a hell of a... We need to make sure this place is secure. Yeah. 